These are traditional V-shaped Stone Age designs of boomerangs. And that they are made like this out of tradition because that's the shape that the aboriginals were able to get them out of the uh, naturally shaped elbows of tree limbs. By today's designs, these are kind of primitive. They're ancient, ancient Stone Age designs. They work okay, but uh, in comparison to some of the fancier shapes, uh, they do lack some things, um, some flight qualities. These were some of the very first ones that I made. I made them a little too big. They're about 20, a little more, maybe 26 inches or so. And uh, you have to watch out. You don't want to catch with them when they're this big because it's so easy to uh, get struck in the face by them. You want something about, oh, 12 inches or anywhere from 13 inches smaller, very easily caught. Once they get about 20 inches, 19 inches and up, uh, you want to really be careful on how you catch those. Uh, you have to be an experienced uh, catcher before you uh, let something that big get that close to your face. And so I put the red one on the bottom and the blue ones on top. Look at the big gap between the, uh, the red and the blue. Uh, again, the blue one is warped up much higher and therefore the shorter flight and that contribute, that's, these small little distances make huge differences in the air. So the positive dihedral uh, greatly affects the rise and the size of the circle of the, the orbit of the flight. The, also the issue is the angle of attack of these wingtips. Um, another thing, another issue is the um, undercuts. Both of these have undercuts and that was kind of a mistake. When I first started making boomerangs I was under the impression that all boomerang wingtips had to have undercuts. That is this 45 degree angle that's cut inward on the under lip and that you don't need that at all. As a matter of fact it decreases the flight range. Um, makes it shorter flights and rise higher. It's not necessary unless uh, your boomerang's striking the ground. Start. Get all that? Yes. Start. Ready? Uh -huh. 